Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sheena with She Is Fab. And on this channel, we do all the things. If you are new here, welcome. If you're oldie but a goodie, hey girl, hey. So today is Saturday, uh, September the 4th. Actually, it's B-Day. Happy birthday, Beyonce. So I just got out the house, it is 3.09. Today's agenda is car wash. Um, I bought a shirt when I was in Chicago. And if you haven't seen that vlog, I will link it down below. Um, I bought a shirt from Zara. It's too small. But I'm down six pounds. Okay. Okay. Your girl started Weight Watchers. Hello. I need to lose. Well, I want to lose. It would be ideal to lose about 10 pounds before I go to New York. I go to New York, I go to New York in about two weeks. But anyway, um, I got to go to Zara. Um, I want to try this new store out. I believe it's called Aritza. It's in the Galleria. Um, I have been um, just watching um, Politics and Fashion. I follow her on Instagram. However, I never really watched her YouTube channel. So I've been binge watching all of her videos. And um, she just talks about building a sustainable wardrobe with classic and luxury pieces. Um, and that really just caught my attention because... I'm known to just be a very impulse buyer. Um, I used to thrift a whole lot and thrift stuff that I just did not need, okay? Um, so I'm, I'm trying to, not trying, I'm going to, um, I'm going to start doing that. I'm going to start paying attention to what I spend my money on um, because it's what I'm in. I'm always in one of those situations where I never have anything to wear. However, I have a bunch of shit, but I do need to be more conscientious about uh, the clothes, um, how, I'm, how I'm spending my money on clothes because I, I think I have a traditional, um, modern, sometimes edgy, very, very boho <laughs> at times um, type of style. It's not that I don't know my style because I do, but when you're an impulse buyer, you just buy shit because it looks good on other people, not really considering that it ain't going to look good on you, right? Anyway, Thank you for listening to my rant. So I want to go to those two stores. Um, and then I'm going to meet my sisters at uh, Boss Cat in the Galleria for an early dinner. So let me get this gas. And yeah, we'll get on down the street. And by the way, man, Drizzy Drake has done it again. Listen, I like Kanye CD. I'm a huge Kanye fan. I'm a huge Drake fan. But baby... Drake did that. Fair game with Travis Scott. If y'all didn't know, Travis is from the from the H. He's he's from Houston. So I, I listen. I, I I love me some Travis Scott, like for real. But uh, I've been jamming Drake since the other day. I think when did it come out? Either yesterday or the day before, and it's just been on repeat um, on my uh, in my car. And I'm loving it. I'm feeling it. So drop down below if you like Drake, if you like if you like his CD. What's your favorite song? Mine's is Fair Game. And then Poppy's Home, baby. I love when Drake sings. I'm sorry. I'm so cheesy and so is he. But I love him. But anyway, let me go get this gas.
Hey y'all, happy Sunday. <clears throat> Excuse me. I am gonna go run a few errands. I need to go to Zara. I didn't go yesterday, I ran out of time. Car wash took longer than I had anticipated and we had reservations for, um, I think 5.30. I need to go and run those errands. But anyway, um, I hope you guys are having an amazing morning. Um, I showed my breakfast, which was an eight point breakfast with Weight Watchers. Ooh down bump my big old head uh, which was an eight point breakfast um i use my starbucks creamer um and it's only two points so uh yeah but anyway weight watchers is going great i've lost six pounds so far um i have a lunch date today and kind of a fun day sunday so uh, we'll see how that goes because honey I ain't trying to gain back the little six pounds that I lost. That's for sure. But yeah, let me get on down this road and um, go run my errand. Still jamming that Drake. Hey guys, so today is Monday. <laughs> um, I had a fabulous weekend. Um, Sunday fun day. I will go ahead and insert a clip. <laughs> Okay, and if you are following me on Instagram, then you already know that I had a Sunday fun day yesterday. So go ahead and put my Instagram name on the screen. So go ahead and give me a follow on Instagram. But I just want to show you guys what I picked up from Aritzia. Um, I did go to Crate and Barrel. I didn't. I didn't purchase anything. Um, I am looking at stemware. Um, I am obsessed with stemware. So. But I didn't purchase anything. I also went to Zara. Zara didn't have anything, um, anything that I liked anyway. So I just returned um, the item that I purchased in Chicago. And I went by um, H&M and I didn't find anything there. So I have something from Aritzia. I have um, a bodysuit that I picked up from Amazon, which I have in another color. And then I have two items from the thrift store. So. Let me show you the two items that I got from Aritzia. Now you will have seen in a previous clip, this black bodysuit that I did um, model for you guys. Uh-oh, that's the other one. 
I did model this one for you guys in the video. Um, I absolutely love this um, bodysuit. It's really, really good quality. These are some of the basic pieces that Politics and Fashion talked about in her video. So I did go ahead and pick this up because this is great for layering in the fall. You guys know I do live in Houston, so we have that crazy weather where it's cold during the day, hot in the afternoon, and then cold again in the evening. So this is perfect to wear under blazers, under sweaters, dad sweaters, um, even throw a white button down on top of it. Um, it's gonna look great. Um, this one does have a snap closure. It is a thong and it's very comfortable. I wore, Like I said, I wore it yesterday um, out for Sunday fun day. And then I also picked up this brown V-neck. Um, I actually showed this in the video, but I did not show you guys when I tried it on. It is a one piece. I actually wanted to wear this piece yesterday. Um, however, I didn't have the proper um, undergarment. If you guys know of a good seamless uh, strapless bra for the big titty committee, okay, uh, let me know down in the comments. Um, I will probably have to wear this with boob tape and then one of those things to cover my nipples because the bra that I have, the half bra that I have, it's not seamless. So you could actually see the um, indention of the bra and I don't like that, guys. I think that looks tacky. Well, for me, I don't like it. So I went ahead and went with the black one yesterday. Um, and then I just purchased another bodysuit like the uh, rust color bodysuit that I wore in Chicago. So I wanted to actually get 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 it in black, but um Amazon would not have um have had time to ship it to me um in time for my trip. So I just went ahead and ordered it in black and then I picked up two items from the thrift store. So the first item that I'm going to show you guys is something that's trending for um, fall and winter of this year. Um, now it's not something that I would spend a lot of money on, um, because I'm really on the fence about it. I like it, but I kind of don't like it. Um, but what I found at the thrift store, um, and for the price today, Value Village had 50% off of everything. So I just stopped in there. Um, and it's a puffer jacket. <laughs> now, this is not my thing. I think this is the second year that puffer jackets have um, been around. Of course, they were very, very popular back in the day. I did not like them then. However, this color, and then it has the antique gold uh, hardware and the price, okay? $7.80 and it is a, it's a uh, good brand, Jones of New York. The material is very soft. This jacket is very soft, guys. It's lined, and again, the gold hardware and detail, it has front pockets. I mean, you can't beat this with a bat. Like I said, I mean, I'm me personally, I absolutely love jackets, but puffer jackets was not really something that was on my radar. And I watched, I think, a video by Mel Sedera, and she was talking about the trends. And of course, I look at the trends online too. And puffer jackets are on trend. So I do like to dibble and dabble in trends. I don't have a problem with it. I'm just not a very trendy type person. But yeah, let me stop rambling. For $3 and some change, y'all gonna see Sheena in this jacket. And I love the back too. You can tell that there was a hood girl but the hood said find me boo all right <laughs> so the second and i do need to wash this so and the second piece um is also a jacket and i picked this up because of the color i have been loving orange and green for some reason like when i saw this do y'all see how good this is there's buttons here button here like a blazer it's lightweight, but at the same time, it's lined. So it will, you know, provide some type of warmth. It's by Liz Claiborne, and this is the price. So it was $4, okay? So I think these two items are aligned with uh, where I'm trying to take my wardrobe, not just buy a bunch of junk from the thrift store, but buy things that I think I can have over time, um, as well as wear over and over again and still be, you know, fashionable, still look good. Um, I would love to, 
um, wear this as a pop of color. I am actually looking on Fashion File right now to try to find me a orange handbag. I do have a couple um, under my favorites, but I just haven't pulled the trigger yet. And I do have a Fashion File item coming. It should be here Thursday, so I will do an unboxing. Um, but anyway, yeah, I got this. Scored this baby at the thrift store. Um, yeah, that's what I picked up. Um, let me know in the comments which piece is your favorite. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you've made it this far and you have not subscribed, girl, what are you waiting on? I would, or guy. I would love to have you um, part of the She Is Fab family. If you enjoy my content, why not hit the subscribe button and see more of me, <laughs> um, my oldies, but goodies. Make sure your um, notification bell is on, like, share, and yeah, I will see you guys in the next, in the next vlog. Bye.